As an interior designer, Alexandra Champalamoud has worked on ornate hotels like the Waldorf Astoria and the Pierre. Her own home, by contrast, is simple, a white clabbered house built in the 18th century by one of the signers of the Declaration of Independence, Oliver Wolcott. In the 37 years since her husband bought the house, Ms. Champalamode said the biggest challenge has been creating a comfortable home while maintaining the authenticity of the historic structure, a national historic landmark. In the decor, she has mixed antique and contemporary pieces from all over the world. The living room has the original brick hearth, which had been covered over. They analyzed the many layers of paint on the walls to find the original colors, such as a brilliant blue in an upstairs bedroom, then used 18th century style paint to recreate them. In the dining room, an early American mirror mingles with candlesticks from England, Italian sconces, and silver from Portugal. When they bought the property, the yard was covered with brambles. They cleared it away and found an apple orchard, lilacs, and quince trees. The lawn was originally sloped at an angle, the couple flattened it to create various sitting and dining areas. They built a swimming pool where she created a mosaic using porcelain and ceramic shards found on the property. They renovated a 19th century carriage house, turning it into her office with a spare bedroom lofted above. There's nothing lavish about this house, says Ms. Champalamode. What it is is it's got such a big soul and we're just carrying that with us. <laughs>